most unique hybrid animals that actually exist. We've all heard and seen supernatural creatures, whether it's in books or on our screens, but did you know that there are some hybrid creatures that exist in reality? Most unique hybrid animals that actually exist. Watch till the end for a surprise. Zorse. Even though it looks like a Photoshop product, this creature is real, though quite rare. Just as the name suggests, it is a hybrid of a horse or a donkey and a zebra. The very first of them appeared in the 19th century when they were bred by Charles Darwin during his experiments. His trials bore fruit and the very first Zorse was born. It functions as any other animal does, but they are more prone to diseases. Also, they are infertile and sterile, meaning there can never be a generation of them in the world without the scientific manipulations. Such a bummer. I was already getting to like them. Coming next is another, even more bizarre hybrid. Stay tuned. Wolfen. If you haven't already guessed by the name, a wolfen is a very rare crossbreed between a female bottlenose dolphin and a horde killer whale. Unlike the rest, these hybrids are the result of natural breeding. There have been multiple sightings of them in the deep sea, but the numbers are unknown. It is believed that these two animals breed because the female horde killer whale is a very rare species. So when the males don't find one of their own, they end up with the closest breed to them, the dolphin. Some theories insist that the animals confuse each other in the waters, but that just sounds like it was made up by some drunk guy. One of these hybrids is currently in captivity, which is so sad. He lies in the Sea Life Park in Hawaii and has been able to reproduce three more wolfins. Beefalo. You must have figured it out already. These hybrids are named by combining the names of their parents. Clap for yourself. You deserve it. Now, the beefalo is a really common hybrid. You might have even eaten it. In America, this crossbreed was specifically made in a laboratory to increase beef production. However, the very first cross was accidental and happened more than a thousand years ago. They became really popular in the 19th century. Reason being, this breed can produce twice as much meat as regular cattle would. What do you guys think? Are humans just selfish and ready to manipulate everything for their own benefit? Or is it okay? Let us know in the comments. Liger. Of all the animals on this list, this is the one you would never want to bump into anywhere. While they may look gorgeous with the beautiful white striped patterns which may fade away into their fur, these beasts are capable of what two adult lions can do. What else do you expect from a crossbreed of a lion and a tiger? It is the largest animal within the Felidae category weight, about 400 kilograms. That's about 800 pounds. There are very few of them in the world as they are bred and raised in controlled environments. Interbreeding of these two animals is also prohibited and highly regulated. Chances are, you may never see one in real life, but thanks to us, we bring them right to your screen. Keep watching for even more unique hybrids. Tigon. Right next in line after the Liger is the Tigon, a ferocious beast that is almost as fierce as the lion-tiger hybrid. This Felidae comes from a tiger male and a lion female. They are quite similar with the Tigon, even in appearance. The only difference comes in size and ferocity. Tigons are less fierce in nature, but you don't want to test them either way. They are also more sterile, but in 1943, a Tigon mated with a male lion and had little cubs, which raised into adulthood. Just like the Liger, you could be arrested or face heavy penalties for trying to interbreed these two animals. Leopon. The Leopon resembles a mythological creature that I am personally in love with. It is one of the rarest crossbreeds between a lioness and a male leopard. Most successful hybrids take the head of a lion and the body of a leopard. While it resembles the beautiful Amit, this adorable creature is just as fierce as any leopard or lion would be, just twice as bad. The very first Leopon was reproduced in the year 1910 while in captivity. Sorry, I actually meant to say Zeus. Sadly, the poor animal couldn't survive and passed on a few months later. I mean, how could it have survived in those cages? Anyway, today there are a hundred other Leopons in the world. They are naturally interbred and most of them happen to be living in zoos. It's very rare to find any of them in the wild nature parks where they belong. Number 8. Growler Bear If there's an animal anyone would love to have as a pet, it has to be a growler bear. These cute, fluffy creatures that look like stuffed animals are the offspring of a polar bear and a grizzly bear. Most of them occur in the wild, though they are very rare and almost impossible to spot. There are less than a thousand growler bears in the world today. Interestingly, them belonging to the same territories, they avoid each other in the wild. 
a fact no scientist or researcher has been able to crack. Enough about all that, I just want to know where I can get one and can they be tamed? Hinny. There's more to this world than you know, like the Hinny, a hybrid reproduced from the mating of a male horse and a female donkey. These are the most common hybrids found in the wild, the reason being the reason being they are bred through a reciprocal process. They appear to be smaller in size than the average horse, but have thick coats of fur on their skin. However, they are sterile and can't reproduce due to many differences in the number of chromosomes in each species. Savanna Cat What most cat lovers don't know is that the Savanna Cat is a hybrid. It is the offspring of the African wild cat and a domestic cat. These adorable pets loved by humans all over the world are often praised for their loyalty and intelligence. They follow their owners around and are the easiest cats to train. This hybrid is the epitome of perfection. Unlike the others on this list, you can buy one for about $2,000. Kama. Now this is a rather unique animal. It looks like a furry supernatural camel and are really adorable. They're a hybrid created from a male camel and a female llama. Their offspring can't reproduce in the wild as they're created artificially by scientists. The very first successful insemination was back in 1998. Since then, man has been creating the breed for one sole reason, to get larger amounts of wool than the llama. I think humans are just weird and greedy, creating a whole new breed just for their wool. What do you guys think? Geep. Can you guess what this is? This ball of cuteness is a geep, also known as a shoat. It is a very rare crossbreed between a sheep and a goat. Despite the fact that these two animals have a lot of similarities and features in common, their offspring is almost always stillborn. For some unknown reason, the offspring doesn't survive birth, and if it does, it will only live for a few hours. There have only been two successful born geeps over the last five decades. However, the animals were sterile and can't reproduce due to the intermediate number of chromosomes they possess. As much as we would all want to have these cute geeps everywhere, it's almost impossible to even see one unless you go all the way to Arizona. Dizzo. Originating in Mongolia and Tibet, the Dizzo is a hybrid between domestic cattle and a yak. Since Dizzos are products of the heterosis phenomenon, they tend to be stronger than their parents and larger in size and they're fertile. In addition, they tend to produce larger amounts of milk and meat compared to cattle and yaks. That's why they're getting quite popular with breeders and farmers across the world. And with that, it's now time for today's best pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber, so if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might even feature it in a future video. Dog Wolf When you go out looking for a dog to adopt or buy, you'll probably go for the common breeds. If you want a security dog, your choices will probably be a German Shepherd or a Rottweiler. If you want a small pet to stay indoors, you'll probably go for a Dachshund or a Chihuahua. Basically, any from the massive list of known breeds. Well, today there's a specific dog that's increasing in popularity every other day. This is the Dog Wolf. And no, we're not talking about the ones in movies, but in real life. There exists a strain of dog breed that reproduces by a male dog and a female wolf. The result is an interesting looking creature that could adopt a mix of temperament and characteristics from their parents. Some dog behaviorists don't recommend these dogs to first time dog owners. They describe them to be trapped in both the wild and tame world, which could lead to them snapping at any moment. Deep down, they want to roam freely in the woods and they also want to be a human's best friend. For this, and so many other reasons, intentional breeding has been discouraged by activists across the world. But it looks like this hybrid is here to stay. Jag Lion A beast by nature, weighing hundreds of tons and ready to pounce on any predator, is a Jag Lion. This particular hybrid is actually a naturally born love child between a male jaguar and a female lion. It was unintentionally bred when its parents used to coexist in the same zoo and were raised together to become inseparable. This jag lion now lives with his parents at the Bear Creek Wildlife Sanctuary in Ontario, Canada. There has only been one of its kind to ever be reproduced successfully. People travel from halfway across the world to see its magnificent beauty. Did you know about any of these hybrids? Which one impressed you the most? please share your thoughts with us in the comments. Thank you for watching, that's it for today, we hope you enjoyed the video.